Reading, mostly. There was just one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know. Sure. But you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs. Uh... Hey, you think that old building's worth checking out? All right. What are you talking about again? Um. Oh, right. Trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs. It's a whole lot of thinking. That's pretty much it. Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. You know, come to think of it, I actually dealt with Alcazar a few decades ago, even before I met you two. Oh, shit. How are you still alive? Well, he wasn't quite the man he is today. Still working his way up the criminal ladder then. I sold his boss a few woodcut prints I'd smuggled out of Japan. He was into shoguns and such. Alcazar was the go-between. What was he like? Soft-spoken, but intense. Like you could explode at the slightest provocation. <laughs> well, he hasn't changed much then, has he? I got my money and got the hell out of it. Whoa! Looks like Shoreline found something. Go slow. You got it. Uh, Victor, you were saying? Right. I got my money and got the hell out of there. Oh, sure, my guns. Here. Come right here. Pirate walks into a bar. Okay, here we go. And he's got the steering wheel sticking out of his crotch. All right. So the bartender goes, hey, man, what's with the wheel? And the pirate says back, ah, it's driving me nuts. <laughs> ah, I love that one. Don't make me leave you out here. Check it out, boys. What is it? probably see all of King's Bay from up here. Yeah. Hey, look. There's the city. Yeah. There's the river valley. So, 
How are you doing? Yeah, still in one piece. I appreciate you coming along for the ride. And especially for negotiating with that rental guy. <laughs> no problem. Hell, I'd be lying if I said I wasn't enjoying myself. <laughs> Me too. Look at this. Quite the view. I just keep waiting to wake up and find myself in solitary or something. <laughs> it's all some kind of dream. Sam. No, no, no guilt trip. I'm just... Let's go find this thing. You bet. Hey guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline marks? I can't tell. We got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. Hey, what do you make of the drawbridge, Nathan? A little out of place. But you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to protect something. Such as pirate treasure? Maybe. Sounds good. Hey, be careful, kid. All right, I'll see if there's something up here. Hey, guys. There's a massive tower just past the drawbridge. Biggest one yet. Bingo. Sam! Special delivery! Whoa, 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 whoa! Hey, kid. You all right? I'm fine. You all right? Yeah. You got this? Mm-hmm. I seen a few. I'll bring the car closer. Hey, 
Oh, you two just relax. I got this. I mean, there's only one crank, you know? Keep up the good work, kid. He's a real charmer. Let's go before more shorelines show up. Hey. Ah. Let's get that bridge down. There we go. Big tower on a volcano. Looks like the end's in sight, huh? You know, not to nitpick, but Avery spent all that money on towers. Would it have killed him to put a guardrail up here? Let's take a look around. So just how much do you owe Alcazar? Uh, half. Half of what? Well, he only knows about the Gunsway heist. Which is worth 400 million. Right, but if Nathan's theory is correct, then there's a lot more treasure. 
Well, you should have told him it was 200,000. <laughs> never tell your partners how much a job is really worth. I wasn't exactly expecting to be partners. There we go. We're all set. Here we go. Let's not get stuck here. Uh oh. under control. This is where we get off, kid. Now, let's find our way in. Let's go claim our treasure, boys. Sam, give me a hand with this. Yeah. Hey, careful with that thing, kid. something back here. Sam? Yeah. Let's do this. Damn. It's breaked over. Heads up! Oh, Jesus! I 
Then heads up. Let's see what we got here. Uh, he's got a lot riding on this. See a treasure, though. Hey guys, coming. <laughs> Come check this out. Saint Dismas. We meet again. So, what do we got? More sigils. There's our boy Avery. Thomas too, and that's uh. Um... That's Adam Baldridge. That's uh, Joseph Farrow, and that's Richard Warren. Hmm. Pirate captains. All right, so maybe your pirate pool theory wasn't so ridiculous after all. <laughs> all right, so uh, let's see. What do you think the trick is here? Got to push a button, pull something. Uh, maybe, maybe one of the arms. Or... Yeah, give it a shot. <coughs> Come on, boys. <laughs> Whenever you're done fondling poor St. Dismas, I think you might want to come take a look at this. The trapezoid is obviously the volcano. The crown, that's King's Bay. We got ourselves a map, gentlemen. Victor, you're a goddamn genius. Hear that, Nate? Genius. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so if we're here, this tower lines up with Avery's sigil. Okay, so then the other sigils must be the towers from Avery's time. Well, I mean, a treasure's got to be in one of them, right? <laughs> yeah, but which one? I count 12 towers. Hey, uh, Victor? Huh? You didn't start smoking cigarettes by any chance, did you? Looks like we're not the first ones here. Hope so. You okay? 
Jesus. Is that all of them? Well, let's hope so. You okay? Yeah, yeah, fine. Sam? Yeah, over here. Hey, what are you doing? Confirming a suspicion. <laughs> Look at this. They figured out the towers, too. Locations, sigils, the works. So now what? Now what? Now we're screwed, okay? Because there's three of us, and there's God knows how many of them, and they have a head start? Yeah, but they don't know which tower to go to yet. Well, that's great, Nathan, because neither do we. Guess we do. <laughs> Look, it's a little worn down. Right there, that's a match. Are you sure? Because, I mean, it could be this one, too. But still, two beats the hell out of 12. All right. I'm gonna take this tower. You and Sully, you take that no, one. No, 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 no. No, Rafe's guys are all over these towers by now. Exactly. So if we want to have a chance to catch them, then we've got to split up. Uh, Sam, just hold up a second, will you? Nate, he's right. These towers are at opposite ends of King's Bay. Damn it. If you run into any of those shoreline clowns, you call us, okay? See you soon. Come on, Nate. We gotta hurry. Yeah. All right, there's our tower. You really think all that treasure's gonna be just sitting in the middle of a goddamn market? Oh, yeah, that'd be crazy. <laughs> but we've seen crazy before. That we have. Excuse me. Too <laughs> It's a lemur. Come on, come say hi. That's all right. <laughs> so cute. Whoa! Hey! Hey, Sully! <laughs> Look who's back. Rabies, Nate. Oh, man. Something's wrong. Mm, that's right. It does smell good. 
It's passing through. Excuse me. Hey, here we go. Locked. I guess we're gonna have to sneak in. Discreetly. Implied by the use of the word sneak. So. Hey, check it out. That window over there is broken. Hey, Sully, I think we can squeeze through here. That'll work. Jesus, long way down. You okay back there? You keep your pace, I'll keep mine. Yeah, well, at least you got a great view, right? Okay, let's see what we got. <laughs> 